All right, day 74. 74 consecutive days of walking at least one mile. I'll put the camera on and we'll get going. All right. Nice and sunny today, but kind of cool. Hey, let me start the timer. All right, let's get going. Put in your guesses how far I'll go, how long it'll take. I had to go to the bank today, so I'm in uh, walking in a different street I've never been on, never walked on, never driven on. In uh, I'm officially, I guess is officially Torrance. So, I never walked down this street before at all. It's like these houses were all built in the 60s. They all look very, very similar. Two flags, two houses in a row with flags. They all look like these uh, one story, two, three bedrooms, I guess. Let's see what we see on this street. Never been here before. There's a little dog in the house. I don't think you're gonna see very many delivery trucks put it at one and a half. And I don't think you're gonna see a bunch of Teslas put it at five and a half and muscle cars, two and a half, dogs. I don't know, it seems really quiet. I say three and a half. See what we see. A yard with a whole bunch of bunnies here for Easter. I got a little, a little bunny post. Happy Easter egg painting. A lot of little flowers there. Now there's a v old vintage VW bus back there. You can see it too well. In the 60s. Let's see a little bit. See what's going on. Comes a car. I always see something on these walks. I see yesterday I saw the 68 Ford Galaxy. Another house with a flag, that's nice. Uh, and the day before that I went to fast cars at auto shop with the all the Ferraris like eight Ferraris. One of the Ferraris was worth $16 million. And I saw a Tesla truck, not at the fast tracks, but just on the walk. And uh, a 55 Chevy, that was two days ago. It's kind of a big house here on this street. It's got at least four bedrooms. Never walked on this street before. It's a BW bug. I haven't seen many of these lately. It's from the last few years, 10 years, I would assume. Looks, yeah. Headlights are glassed over. The nice yard here, look at this. Look at a nice little purple, purpley. Little flowers up to their walkway and little porch. That's nice. Here's a house with a front door on the side. I see that sometimes. It doesn't have a front door, it's got a side door. I've seen a few houses like that. Must have been a popular design <coughs> that time period. The house with a red door on the corner. 
definitely a different house more modern than the rest of the houses on this street not many windows though the house with a yellow door look at this the first Tesla A little bit different architecture too than the rest of the houses. Nice and sunny today, but a little cool. That's 62. Wind chill 58. a yellow house with a blue door this house doesn't hardly really have any windows they're all shut up and the yard is kind of a overgrown Guess they just put some kind of weeds in there and let them grow so they don't have to cut it and this yard hasn't been mown in a while either the yellow house the blue door People kind of love the bright colored doors. There's some type of vintage car here, but I'm not going to find out what it is because he's got it covered up. comes a yard full of gravel man just a bunch of rocks I guess they didn't want to have to water the yard or cut it so they just put a bunch of rocks and cactus in there yeah that's what they like it's got a bunch of rocks and cactus Is a house or a... It's a house. They got three balconies up there. One big balcony all the way across. I guess it's a house. Not apartments. New homes now selling. Uh-oh, here comes an ambulance. Oh, no car from Maryland look at that see too many cars from Maryland I guess the ambulance already walked and went by <sighs> let's see if we can, can, if we can cut back up somewhere Oh, this must just be an alley, but maybe we can cut up a block and go back up the other street. Uh, it doesn't look like I can cut through. There's a McDonald's. I heard uh, McDonald's are going to start selling Krispy Kreme donuts. Oh, boy. Can't wait for that. Everybody be going to McDonald's to get a Krispy Kreme donut. You can get them at the grocery store though, so. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna have to go back up this way. I should have turned when I had a chance. It's a whole block walking up a street with not much. I'd rather walk back up this way, I think. I think I can cut over in a minute. Well, if you're playing along and write down how many 
days in a row this is for you if you've done 10 days 15 days in a row a mile a day write it down in the comments come back every day This is day, uh, let's see, 74 for me, 74 days in a row, going for 100. See if I can make it to 100 days. I think I can probably do it. The key is just to uh, get out. Get out, it's only about 10 minutes out, 10 minutes back, so nice pink bushes. The hardest part's just getting out. Once you're out, it's nice. If, if you walk on the treadmill, then you can take this video and watch it while you're walking on the treadmill. It's kind of like being out. But write down your goal in the comment section if you want to try to do a half a mile a day for 30 days or a mile a day for 30 days. That's how I started out, just trying to do a mile a day for 30 days. They say people with written goals are 10 times more likely to achieve the goal than if you just think about it. So, so just write it down in the comments. Come back every day, update it. How far you walk, total number of miles. Maybe, I haven't added it up, but I think I'm close to 100 miles by now. Probably 70. 73, four days, I haven't added it up late yet. All right, we can cut across this street and go down, go back up the other street and see what we see. I never walked over in this neighborhood before, so kind of quiet. It's not like one car on the street and one person walking, no dogs. It's an old VW bus again. He's already seen one. I don't know if I'd be able to cut across up here or not either. It's like a nursery where these power lines are. So that's why I couldn't cut across. Let's see what's this. VW bus looks like. Hey, a lot of nice purple flowers right here covering up this fence. But a lot of nurseries where these power lines are. Nobody wants to live under a power right beside a under a power line. People live beside them. These purple flowers all the way down. know what year this VW bus is. It's a late 60s, I guess. I don't know. Let me know if you know. We've got two different color doors. Let's see what the back looks like. Right, late 60s, I'd say. I don't know. Seen better days, though. It's an old Chevy truck. I guess that's from the 60s too. Can't really tell. Maybe 70s, early 70s. Got a Corvette in front of it, but I can't see what. Can't see. Make, there goes a first delivery truck, a mail truck. May be the only one I see. Yeah, there's not a lot going on in this neighborhood. It's pretty quiet. Kind of nice, huh? It's the second Tesla, two white ones. I guess that you could see that Corvette in the garage, but couldn't really see it that well. I guess we can count that as one muscle car. All right, I guess we'll turn up here. We're already at 0.7. The truck. 
ます。See what's going on up here. Never even been on this street before. House up there, in a stained glass second floor, it looks like a church. It's a bedroom, I guess. I don't know. Attic? I don't know. Let's go back toward the car. All right. Let's see what's going on around here, the blue house. The sky blue, beachy color. It's kind of a kind of a big house here. I'm not even sure where the doors are. It's kind of got that farm, southern farm look. I guess the doors are on the other side. I don't have any doors over here. Maybe here's a door. Hidden. It's kind of hidden, I guess. Yeah. Easter Bunny. What kind of tree is that? That leaf on that tree, I've never seen any. It's an old elk from the 70s, I think. Mid, early mid 70s. Seventy-four, seventy-five, I guess. See a lot of these El Caminos for some reason. I don't know. People like to have a car that's like a truck. I'd say that's seventy-four, seventy-five-ish. All right. Always something vintage car or something. I think I've seen one dog. I saw a dog in the window. There's the one male man I've seen. It's a male woman. What do they call these cars? Ramblers, I think. This blue one around 20 years ago, I guess. I don't think they make them anymore. It's a Rambler? I can't remember the name of it. It's at least 20 years old, I'd say. Cruiser, PT Cruiser. A Rambler is kind of similar. It was around about the same time. Similar model. First place we've seen any construction. Just a quiet, kind of a quiet street over here. There's torrents. If you don't live here, no reason to be down the street, really. Unless you're a mailman. Or somebody doing a walking channel. modern house for this street. Oh, that's nice. A lot of windows. Little porch. And most of these houses look like these two. And 
the 60s, I guess. That's probably a two bedroom, one bath, both of them. All three of them, all four of them. Almost all of them. Probably built a whole row of them down here. And every now and then they sell one and tear it down and build a bigger, bigger one. Here's the third Tesla, only three Teslas today. You should count that Corvette as a, mus as a muscle car, but you couldn't really see it that well. I don't know if that really counts. All right, I guess we'll head back. It's very quiet. Quiet little neighborhood. I'll okay, up here a minute. Not much going on. Those are, what kind of trees those are? I mean, they're not really palm trees, but they look like a derivative of a palm tree. See if this street puts us through, or I gotta go back. I don't know if this put me through to the bank or not. There's another Tesla, what's that, five? I think I'm gonna have to cut back. Number five, Tesla. All right, well, maybe I'll come down this street next time. I don't see much of, if you get back, it'll be about the, mile in I see one one person one dog in the window kind of a muscle car a Corvette I mean I kind of saw it and we're about six Teslas and one mailman it's a kind of a sleepy neighborhood I guess it's good quiet Nice. There's several more streets down there to walk through, but I'm not doing it today. All right, I guess we'll head back. Almost at the, to 1.15, almost there. The two more Teslas, is that seven or eight, eight or nine? A big RV. A trailer, I guess it's not really an RV. You can sleep in it, but you gotta tow it. And it's from the, at least the 80s, I guess. I guess they go on some trips. There's a nursery over here. I'll walk over there and see what they got. Get the gate open. I want to go in. I don't think it's that be that interesting, though, to be honest. There's a whole bunch of pine trees, it looks like. All right. There's more stuff down there. They got the gate open over there, too. That El Camino will be the car of the day. Might be the most interesting thing we saw on this walk. I never walked over here before. I thought I'd do it and see what I saw. Here comes another Tesla. I think that's nine or ten. Well, gonna be really close, pretty close on the number of Teslas. Almost all white. All white Teslas. Oh, there's another one, 10. That's close on the Teslas and under everything else, dogs, delivery trucks, muscle cars. All right.
right, so that's gonna be it for today. Back to where we started. If you guessed 1.16 in 24 minutes, 27 seconds, you are the winner. That's it for today. If you like the video, check back tomorrow. Subscribe, new videos every day. Keep the streak alive, we'll see what we see tomorrow. All right, that's it. See you tomorrow.